On the screen, you'll see two personal books. One is a demo resource that I've entitled Multi-Level Table of Contents. The other is a legitimate personal book called The Greatest Day That Ever Was. Notice that I've displayed the table of contents in each of these resources. Pay close attention to the hierarchical structure in each table of contents. And each section in the hierarchical structure is hyperlinked. That means we can click a section title and jump to that location in the personal book. In this quick clip, I want to show you how to produce that hyperlinked table of contents and that hierarchical structure. All of the action is in the source document, your docx file. So I'm going to return to a Word document. You'll see a simple document on the screen and you'll see headings 1 through 9. Word produces nine different levels or nine different headings and Logos recognizes all nine levels in the personal books. So if you want to tag text as heading or level one, all you do is select the text and then click the button heading one. If you want heading two, you select the text and then click heading two. It's as simple as that. So let's return to a legitimate Word document. So here is a sermon manuscript from my good friend Rob Morgan. The title of his sermon is It's a Great Day to Take a Walk. So I'm going to select that text and then click Heading 1. You'll notice that Word formats it according to the Heading 1 style, but I want my text to be center justified, so I simply click that button. In Word, you can go through and change the font, the colors, the styles of all of your headings. Now I'm going to page down until I come to one of the points of Rob's sermons. Here it is. He values you for who you are. So I'll select that text and then click Heading 2. Again, I'm going to center justify it. And I'll page down until I come to another point of the sermon. Select the text and then Heading 2. Again, center justify. That's just the style that I like. And then when we build our book and return to Logos, the book builder automatically, automatically creates this hierarchical structure for us in our table of contents. And remember, each of these sections is hyperlinked. We can click on it and jump to that location in the resource.